What up, y'all? It is your boy Darius, and we're back, y'all. So, we have a special reaction I want to do today. Now, it's been a while since I did a WE reaction. It's been a while. So, I want to do this one WE's Top 20 Most Savage Segments. So, we're going to check this out. Another ton, guys. Let's get this thing going. You have something that belongs to me. Heavyweight championship. To bury you into the ground. Take back what's mine. You know what? Stone Cold was right when he called you out on his podcast. Oh. Okay, well, what did it, what did Stone Cold say to Dean Ambrose on Stone Cold's podcast? Cause I know he did an interview on Stone Cold's podcast back in 2016. Or oh, 2017, one of those two years. No, this is from 2016. Okay, yeah, 2016. What did this Stone Cold say? All you've been showing the WWE Universe is that you got no balls. Bra. You're a lazy part-timer. Okay, I gotta pause that part. When Dima said that John's is a lazy part-timer. No, the only one I'll say is a lazy part-timer is Brock Lesnar. That was the only one I could say. He doesn't even show it up to bend the tile. I could put Roman Reigns in that category as well as well. Because he never defended his tile as well. So that's a whole different story. So let's continue. You can't get it done in the ring anymore. I know what a lie detector test is. I know how it works. The only thing simple around here is your jokes. You, you, you kind of shock me. You're just like everybody else here. Why don't you suck up to them a little bit more, huh? I wasn't paying attention. I apologize. Yeah, you didn't pay attention in wrestling school either, jerk. The Miz sucks. <laughs> am I lying? Ask me. No, he doesn't. But your mom does. Greensboro's oh! a dump. Am I telling the truth? Comes out here right now and apologizes to me. Mr. McMahon and company. Yeah. The owner of the WWF. Anyone deserves an apology around here. It's me. You put your hands on me, and I might do it again. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh my. Uh oh. Don't put your sorry ass up the ramp, because I ain't got a damn thing to say to you. You come out here and demand an apology. Hell, son, I got one for you. Uh oh. You don't believe you. Oh, yeah. Also, there's Cena. Pair of trunks away from being a jabroni. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere just like that bald spot on your head ain't going anywhere. I would so much rather be bald than have them pipe in fake crowd noise for my matches because nobody cares. Oh, Dale, he got We all know you don't have it here. Dale. You really need to work on that last bit. <laughs> so the Rock's come to one conclusion, China, and that conclusion is this. Oh, you turn. just need to get some. Put her down on her knees where she belongs. Oh, come on. You look pretty damn good on your knees, China. It almost looks like a natural position. Shut your eyes and enjoy the magic of the rock. No way he would ever kiss a piece of trash like you. Oh, that's cold. Everything that the Divas era stood for made me sick to my stomach. How far you were actually able to go? The absolute minimum amount of talent. You leached off of the names of your men. The only thing that's gonna be stopping me. Okay, I gotta say this. Rona, she's really terrible. She need work on her mic skills. She really does. I think though, what they need to do is get like a veteran female, kind of like when John Cena did to Roman Reigns. That's the thing that she need to work on. Evolution is gonna be the referee, and everyone knows they're not very good at holding me back. We have broken more barriers than you ever have. The only door you ever knocked down was the door to John Cena's bedroom. Ooh. He eventually threw you out of that exact same door. Your marriage would not have fallen apart. Always came up a little bit short. It was that the field I was playing on was just too damn big. Oh, no! <laughs> Even a 747 Look small when you're flying it into the Grand Canyon. Oh. Why don't you fight me? Me and the great wide open over here. What do you say? Going from New York to Toronto. Yeah, there was Toronto was short, sure, stepping on that part. Elias, shut your mouth. It's kind of like the Stanley Cup. They'll never see it in their lifetime. <laughs> kind of like you uh, winning a WWE championship. Oh. I want to walk with Elias. 
that has to break it to your Trish. I don't date women in their 60s. <laughs> the reason why you humiliated Tommy Dreamer. Let me tell you something, Dad. This is my WWE ring. You greedy, selfish, miserable son of a bitch. If I had a head like yours, I'd have it circumcised. Oh. Your wife's a whore. Oh. Your kids are bastards. Uh oh. I'll kick you in the nuts and you'll smile at me and like it and show me some respect. I want you to bring back the WWE ice cream bars. The main event of WrestleMania being John Cena against your buddy Dwayne. That's the rock for nobody who watches bad Disney movies. You want to punish people for actually liking professional wrestling? Guys like Colt Cabana, guys like Luke Gallows. I apologize, you son of a bitch. You have become the New York Yankees. Oh. I have got to know if you trust me to be. Keeping your pearly whites pearly white isn't easy, especially when your husband is the god of wine. I've done it again. Idiot wonder, Tess. Oh boy. Just let me let me cut you off, if you don't mind, boss. You know nobody else in this ring has got the guts to tell you. I didn't stutter. Hey, boss. I'm over here. We don't like you. You live by a motto called DTA. Don't trust anybody. DTA now stands for Don't Trust Austin. This. Did you smoke the prototype to that championship you have around you? Did you get beat up by a girl at the Rumble, man? Did you get tossed over the top? I came to put a champion to sleep. And when I defang the Viper, trust me, ain't gonna come from nowhere. I'm talking to hey, 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 do me a favor. Why don't you act like this is an AA meeting and you shut your mouth while I'm sharing with the crew? Oh. Be honest with me. How's our old girl Wendy doing? Oh. Chris Jericho will screw you. Anybody knows anything about screwing, it's you. <laughs> you are not. Good. Oh. Wow. Ever see the WCW title again? Is that the sorry line? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> you disrespect it. You're no worse than all these hypocrites sitting in this arena right now. I'm scared to death of your father's return because when he comes back, your time running this show is over. You don't have a clue what's going on around here, do you? If you spend as much time worrying about your own career as you did my leadership skills, maybe you'd still be world champion. Ooh. Your, your time and authority here is running out, and you know that. I don't give a damn what you say anymore. You're fired. But you're not as big of a deal as you think you are. It's called a promo. Shut your mouth. <laughs> you're the big dog. You're going to have to learn how to do it, so go ahead. <laughs> you're just a fake bitch. Yes, Roman Ray, he's, yeah, because he doesn't know how to do his promo. Yeah, John Cena sure him with this part. The one guy in the WWE that John Cena can't see. Congratulations. It took you five years to cut a halfway decent promo, but now I'm about to shrink you down to size. Oh, boy. I'm still here because you can't do your job. Ooh. I can do this part-time better than you could ever do it full-time. I'm fighting to win, and you're fighting not to lose. You need to watch your mouth, rich boy. Let me take you back to WrestleMania two years ago. Your legacy died. The very day that you were born, you've been your daddy's Before the new day existed, dark matches and pre-shows is all you get. Just don't get all rated R like your boy Xavier Woods. <laughs> then you used to be Jamaican. Nah, you was Jamaican, but he stayed in the lane. Please always remember, you were absolutely nothing till your wife put you on Total Divas. Oh. <laughs> Y'all should get back to doing what you do best, and that's carrying bags for who? For Roman! <laughs> we're having a baby. 
great man that uh -oh. interrupted a deeply personal moment between my wife and I. You don't know when to shut your mouth. That's why you're kicked out of WWE tour buses, and that is why you are kicked out of the WWE locker room. You think you chose to bring your personality to the cruiserweight division? There was nowhere else for you to go. You were championship material. Your best friend wouldn't have abandoned you. Look at the you're nothing more than a con artist with a couple of catchphrases. How I feel about John Cena. And no, that, that movie star isn't you in The Chaperone. How was your movie, by the way? Mine went straight to DVD, just like yours. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fires people around here. You are funk man over here, huh? Personally, face to face, fire Vladimir Kozlov on Friday, huh? For you, all of this, gone, just like that. I'd rather be a one-hit wonder than a phony. Well, hey, you know, talking's sort of what I do, but I can also kick your teeth down your throat. You didn't know how to handle Braun Strowman, and you're never around to. You gotta be kidding me. I think you deserve a shot at this. You don't deserve Oh, damn. I drag us all back down to reality. Reality wow. is I kicked your Last name. That's the reality. Hey, you look at me when I'm talking to you, or we can straighten this oh. Who got beat down by Braun Strowman last night? That's facts. Look at me. Now look at Braun if you can find him. Damn, man. These these W wrestlers got the best. Got the best uh, clap bats of all time. Cena, of course. Samojo, of course. I also put Brock in there. Who y'all think had the best Savage? Uh, that's it for this video, guys. Make sure you like the video, make the subscribe channel as well, and I'll see you guys next video. Stay up. Peace.